What's going on guys, it is Lord of Lego here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Hogwarts Professors from the Lego Harry Potter minifigure series. So, to start off, let's move all the characters out of the way so we can take a look at, um, probably the, uh, not my favorite, but a very good version of Professor Flitwick. I love the way that this figure turned out, this hair piece is just something, out of, it's out of this world how Lego could print, how Lego did so many new hair pieces for this series. It's is an awesome new hair piece. I don't know if it's useful for anything else, but Flitwick, but looks so accurate. And the bow tie looks great. And um, this little thing right here is a new mold. So that's two new molds on one figure. Um, and then the uh, and then there's some good to coattails. And then a regular just brown wand. And the wands can go like this in the series, so you can point it at stuff. But um, very cool figure overall. Next up is Professor Dumbledore, or Headmaster, and um, I really like this figure. Probably either the best or second best out of the um, Harry Potter series itself, because this figure is so great. Um, some, uh, two great new molds for the hair and the beard. Awesome. Uh, some nice printing overall, but no back printing, and I understand why. Um, you know, his hair is covering his whole back anyways. And, um, this is also very, uh, pensive, I think that's what it's called. This allows you to look into the memories. Awesome how it has that glare to it. That's an awesome new piece. And then, I will sort of complain about the Elder Wand. Uh, Lego needed a new mold for an Elder Wand. And the color is off on this. But, um, it's still pretty good to get, just for the figure. And now moving on to Professor Trelawney. Um, this figure is pretty awesome as well, and um, this new mold for the hair is awesome. I think all of these professors have new hair molds, and that fits her perfectly. Um, very frisky in the back. Looks great. A new mold for the teacup, where you can separate the saucer from the cup, as you can see right there. And then, um, the figure itself is great, great printing overall, and that headpiece is so useful outside of the Harry Potter realm. And now, for the last figure of the Harry Potter, um, professors, we have Mad-Eye Moody, and I love this figure. It's such a great figure. New hair mold, uh, this great printing, triple molded legs, so there's the silver, the dark blue, and then the, um, the sort of sandy color, I don't know, like the lighter brown, the lighter brown color. And then if you turn his head around actually, you can see that it is in fact Barty Crouch Jr. and it comes with another hairpiece. So you can put the hairpiece on top of him and make him into Barty Crouch Jr. and I really love this figure, probably one of my favorites of the entire series. And he also comes with the Polyjuice Potion. In case you didn't know what that little maraca th looking thing over there was. But, um, yeah, that's pretty much it for these figures. Let me know what you guys think of them in the comments below. And, um, tell me if, what you want to see in the future of these videos, um, for the minifig videos. So, um, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later. Peace out.